Hey, I'm Brennan with Revzilla, and today we are checking out the Built Techno 3.0 Modular Cena Bluetooth Helmet available at Revzilla.com. So say that title 10 times fast. I'm gonna to refer to this as the Techno 3.0. And the big benefit here, we do have a modular helmet, which means that you can open and close the chin bar. You've got an internal sun visor, which is nice. That gives you a lot of versatility, especially for touring riders out there, or people who are just commuting. But as you can see, the biggest benefit is going to be the Cena unit that is fully integrated into the helmet. This is the DW06 unit. So when you buy this helmet right out of the box, all you gotta do is connect it with your smartphone and hit the road. I mean, it's that simple. You don't have to wire anything in there. So that's the major benefit with this particular helmet. But before we get going and get rambling, and with all the details, you guys know how I can be. I did want to take a second and talk about the overall fit. It has an intermediate oval internal shape, which means it's going to be a bit more elongated front to back than it's going to be side to side. That's going to work well for most of the American market, including myself. Now, I measure just over 22 and a half inches, or right at 22 and a half inches, I should say, around the full circumference of my head. I typically wear a size medium, and medium fits me spot on with this particular helmet. No surprises there. So get your measurements, reference the sizing chart, and you should be all set. Now keep in mind this helmet will ship to you for free, and as always, we do have a price match policy in place that is there to ensure that you are getting the best deal around. Now let's talk about the shell here. We've got a composite shell main construction. It's DOT only, and the shell is actually two shell sizes. I would have loved to see a little bit more of a shell breakdown. You're looking at an extra small to a 2XL in that first shell, and then a 3XL to a 5XL in the second shell. Knowing that most of us are gonna be in that extra small to 2XL range, I would have loved to see that at least split, uh, you know, I have two shell sizes in there and then that final shell, the third shell could be the 3XL to 5XL. So for me personally, I would have loved to see that, you know, it, it is uh, going to add a little bit of size to the overall helmet as well as the weight. So if we could have got an additional shell size, I think that would have helped out a good bit there. Again, DOT only, you're looking at three pounds, 14 ounces in a size medium with this helmet, which is actually not too bad. You've got an internal sun visor, a fully integrated Bluetooth system, and and you've got a modular helmet, so you've got these hinge systems which tend to add weight. So three pounds, 14 ounces at this price point in a size medium, uh, I'm not gonna knock them on that one. Now let's swing over to the front of the helmet. We've got an active vent here so you can open and close that. That's also where you're gonna find the mechanism to open the modular uh, or the chin bar, making this, of course, a modular helmet. You can open that up and close it. It's just a simple trigger point right there on the inside. Um, so very easy to adjust and it is gonna stay locked very well when it's in that top right position. Towards the top, you've got an active vent at the top uh, around the forehead and then some exhaust vents here towards the rear. So that's that combination is gonna create that Venturi effect that we like to say so much, and it's gonna pull the airflow through the helmet, through the EPS, and allow it to escape the rear, keeping you nice and cool when you're out there riding. Kind of a sporty design, nothing overly aggressive, but you can see those sporty uh, lines with this helmet. The shield does have um, some really good detents to it, and it is pinlock ready. The pinlock insert is not included in the box, so that is something you will need to pick up if you wanna eliminate the fogging, but I like that it is pinlock ready, so it can accept that altogether. Together. Again, internal sun visor. The mechanism is right here on the left hand side. I do like that design. And one thing I want to mention, we've got the Cena unit here, which is really great. It's fully integrated. That's awesome. If you have your own Bluetooth communication system and you still like this overall design, there is the Nomad. That does exist. It does not have the fully integrated Bluetooth system uh, in it. And it still has the visor mechanism over here on the left hand side, right behind uh, the face shield mechanism. I like that because if I I'm adding a Bluetooth system, it's gonna go right down here on the neck roll. And a lot of times manufacturers will put that internal sun visor mechanism right in the way. So it's really frustrating. I like the placement of this internal sun visor. Once you do that a few times, it becomes muscle memory. Uh, it, it's a really great position to put that internal sun visor. So just something to consider. If you're looking at the Nomad, uh, you can add your own Bluetooth communication system to it. Speaking of that though, let's dive into this. This is the Cena DW06 previously on the Techno 2.0 which this is replacing, it was a Cena DW05. And now we've got Bluetooth 4.1, you've got a longer range, the firmware is upgradable, you can actually link it up to uh, the Cena app as well. So a lot more uh, capabilities with the Cena DW06 and it is very, very simple to use, works very well. And again, you can see that it is fully integrated on the inside. There's your microphone and you've got the speakers on the inside as well. So right out of the gate, you turn it on, connect it with your phone, 
you're good to go. So let's work our way to the interior now that we've discussed that a little bit. And that's the major benefit is obviously gonna be that fully integrated Bluetooth system. For some people, it's not gonna be the best option because you can't take this off. It's not designed to be removed from the helmet and transferred to another helmet if you pick something else up. So that is something to keep in mind there. If you have your own Bluetooth unit, check out the Nomad. Let's work our way to the interior here. Double D-ring closure, pretty straightforward there. And I'll start removing the cheek pads. Antibacterial, moisture wicking. You can see the contour, very comfortable, very straightforward. You can wash these. Um, very easy to remove these, as you can see, and you can see these little perforations, if you will, because the speakers are behind that and they wanna make sure that the volume gets through. And then you can see, let me go ahead and open that chin bar and get that out of the way a little bit. And you can see the speakers are already integrated. And I'll go ahead and start removing the liner system. I'm gonna to have to pull on this a little bit to get this one out. And I like that snap system actually. It might be a little finicky to get in and out, but there's no pressure points whatsoever on the forehead. So very easy to remove, just takes a little bit of wrestling there. And of course, all that stuff is completely washable. Um, and then right here on the interior, this is not designed to be removed. This little gray piece right here, it's creating some space for you to help with the overall airflow and just add some additional comfort between the liner itself as well as the EPS on the inside. But of course, you can see the speakers that are integrated already as well as that microphone right there on the side of the helmet. Of course, you're gonna get the speakers on both the left and right hand side. I like the, uh, the versatility that you're getting with something like this. Again, it's a you know, modular helmet. You can open and close the chin bar. You've got a fully integrated Bluetooth communication system as well as an internal sun visor. So a lot going on with this helmet. But of course, if you're looking for more details, feel free to click the info button on your desktop or mobile device. And that's gonna take you over to revzilla.com where you can read other rider reviews. And as always, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to our gear geeks. Give them a call at 877-792-9455 or simply shoot over an email cs at revzilla.com. Thanks for hanging out with us today and taking a closer look at the Built Techno 3.0 helmet. I'm Brandon, keep it pinned.